This is Karen Ramsey, and today I want to talk about food packaging for so-called health foods. Well, a friend brought over this Sanyukia Udon noodles thinking that they were vegan health food. Um, and if you look at the packaging, it looks pretty healthy, right? It says in big print, no MSG added, cholesterol free, and low fat. And so you think, oh wow, that sounds great, right? But if you look at the back, in very small print, it says, contains wheat, soy, milk, and fish. So this is very far from being a vegan product. Um, it also says no MSG, and I found in here hydrolyzed vegetable protein, which is MSG, monosodium glutamate. And so there's MSG in a lot of places that are deceiving, all right? If you see hydrolyzed vegetable protein, yeast extract, even very often natural flavoring, those are all MSG. Things like um, carrageenan, a lot of the soy sauces like Bragg's liquid aminos have MSG created in the processing. So even though many people in the raw food movement and in the vegan movement think that soy sauces such as Bragg's are healthy and that they can be added to dishes you have to be careful with the MSG that's created in the processing of the product. So this is definitely not a health food. Um, for those who think that there isn't any dairy in it, there's, um, it says right here, lactose, fermented fish powder, interesting. Also maltodextrin, MSG again, and it's very toxic, so why would you want to eat something that has all of these additives in it? Uh, caramel color, sodium bicarbonate, disodium inosinate, disodium guanylate. I can't even pronounce these things. This is a science project. So for those of you who are vegan or um, trying to live a high raw lifestyle and still have some cooked and packaged foods. You want to be really leery of what you are purchasing because this was a health conscious friend who brought this packaged food to my house. And this is not something that we should be eating or giving to our families.